Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix phone mobile data not working. Before we start, hurry up and check out these stuff for just under this video. So let's get started. Now, if you're having issues with your phone's mobile data, there are a few things that you need to do here and check for you to solve this issue. The first is we need to check a few things here. So first is to make sure that your signal or your network signal strength is actually pretty good. Now having your signal strength at one bar or zero bars at all at the top right here would mean that your internet connection or your mobile data might not work as expected. So in this case, you might want to move near to a window or somewhere else and just have some empty space or airspace in front of you and basically get those signals. But in this case, make sure you have a stable, in, uh, in this case, stable network itself but if you do have like stable inter uh in this case network coverage in your area or in your place right now the next thing you want to do is you want to maybe restart your device sometimes doing a quick restart can actually solve a lot of issues but then again if that doesn't work the next thing you want to do here is you want to make sure that you have the latest updates now in this case you want to go ahead and go to your settings in here from here you want to go to about phone and click on update if you see if you do see an update button there in this case uh, wait for the update to complete restart your phone and once you've done that see if that solves the issue now another thing that you might want to do here is to basically start contacting your network provider sometimes there might be some issues or downtime with your network provider so it's actually best to contact them so if you do have any means of contacting them like for example a number they could call any socials like Facebook, Twitter, or even the YouTube uh, channel if they have one and see any updates regarding any downtimes within your area. But yeah, so in this case, the next thing you want to do here is you want to also try changing a few settings here. So one of them is to basically disable your roaming here. So in this case, I would suggest you to go to your phone here, go to settings, and you want to go ahead and look for mobile networks. Now in here, you should be able to see data roaming here. Go ahead and click on it. And from here, if you do see international roaming here, I would suggest you to set this to never. Now, in this case, once you've done that, see if that solves the issue. Now, another thing that you could do here is to basically also disable automatic uh, network selection. So in this case, uh, your phone by default actually selects the network that they use whenever you're using your phone. In this case, you could go ahead and open up your settings here like what we just did. Go to mobile networks. You want to go ahead and click on your SIM card here, and you want to go ahead and click on mobile networks. Now, in this case, you want to turn this off, and once you've turned this off, this might take a few seconds or a few minutes to load up, but once you've turned this option off, you should be able to see a number of networks that you could actually select. So in this case, you might want to select one of them and see if that solves your issue. Now, another thing that you could do here is to basically reset your network settings. So in this case, you want to go ahead and go to your settings here. You want to scroll down a bit. You want to go to more connectivity options. And in here, what we need to do is we need to scroll down a bit here. You want to go ahead and click on our set Wi-Fi, mobile networks, and Bluetooth. Now in this case, uh, you can go and click on reset settings at the very bottom here. And from here, just confirm by using your PIN. Now, by the way, some information here. If you do proceed with resetting your network here, it will actually reset every information. So this will actually disconnect or reset your Wi-Fi, your mobile data, and any information regarding your Bluetooth if you paired any devices with your uh, mobile phone here. But yeah, so those are the things that you could do here to probably solve this issue. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.